Lerma, top of the box, Ryan Christie, over the top, lovely ball for Billing, right for it, Bill Billing again! Second game in a row, a teasing ball from Christie into his path, and Bill Billing with his inferior right foot, once again finds the ball in four of the net, 16 gone, formed after a huge let off at the other end, the one up on Luton. Well, he keeps finding the net, doesn't he? What a great run that was, broke the upside trap, hard and low into the corner. Christie's gone across to take it again, they take it short, the Cherries see a two-on-one opportunity, and now Anthony back to the top of the box, Jordan Zamora, then Anthony again, Christie desperately hanging on left side, trying to stay on side, which he's managed to do, Ryan Christie, in it comes towards Solanke with the header! Another landmark for him on target again. Dom Solanke 2 0. Yeah, fantastic work from the corner. A little set play routine. Nice little clip to the far post. Punches the ball down. Goalkeeper's got no chance right in the corner. Short corner again taken by Luton. Taken to Jordan Clark to the top of the box and Cornick, who takes a touch outside the D. Flicked in by Naismith, headed clear by Billing. Then Lerma and Solanke will combine. They should have combined to clear, but Solanke miscued his clearance. And now a chance inside the right for Berry. We'll try and flash it across goal. And it's an own goal of Lloyd Kelly. And Bournemouth really have only got themselves to blame there. A miscued clearance. And Luton take advantage. Mark Travers is hurt in the build-up. But as it flashed across the six-yard box, it looked like the last touch came off Lloyd Kelly. And Luton have got the goal they've been threatening with 26 minutes remaining. Cherries 2, Luton 1.